We all know how aliens have shaped our planet's landscape, our history, our way of life. But today, we dive deep into how aliens have influenced our pop culture. This is Ancient Aliens. Our society's fascination with celebrities has gone on for hundreds of years. But why are we as humans so drawn to these people? And how do they become celebrities in the first place? Some people think Post Malone's singing voice is just Justin Bieber's voice. Slow down. Crazy, right? Or maybe not so crazy. In the year 1962, the movie To Kill a Mockingbird was released. No one knew who Gregory Peck was before then, and all of a sudden he was shocked into stardom. But where did he come from? He couldn't have just appeared overnight, or could he? We know that the flop charm race of aliens made contact with the Earth in the year 1962. The crater that their spaceship created when it crash landed is Prof. And since the aliens aboard that ship had no way of returning home, they found a way to fit into our society by becoming the people we least expect to be aliens. Celebrities. Horse Malone's singing voice isn't just Justin Bieber slowed down. They're the same person, the same alien that is. And it all started with Gregory Peck. I have studied the 1962 Florbtron landing in depth. It's one of only three times in our planet's history that an alien has come to the Earth and stayed. I personally believe that thousands of different alien species have visited the Earth and may still be living among us, but we only know of three for sure. The first was, of course, the Zeltor meteor that killed the dinosaurs. Our ancestors crawled out of it and made a home here. The third landing that we know of is the Doubtforn landing, which we will not be discussing. Since the days of Gregory Peck, we have all been influenced by the very same alien in our everyday lives. The alien loved the fame and fortune that came along with being Gregory Peck, and he wanted more of it. So he began splitting his body into more and more parts. The Fortron body is like that of a starfish, which is of an alien. If you cut off one limb, a fully functioning creature will grow up and go about life as normal. So that's what the Lord Trump, Gregory Peck, decided to do. Almost any celebrity you can think of originates from this original Gregory Peck Lord Trump. Despite its many contributions to our culture, the Lord Trump hacks humans. That's why when someone says, oh, I met Emma Roberts, she was an asshole, it's because Emma Roberts is a Flobtron. The Flobtron is an asshole. He hides us. This creature has complete control over our planet. Justin Bieber and Post Malone are just the beginning. The Florbtron is also Kendall Jenner, Lil Yachty, Ariana Grande, Missy Elliott, Haley Bieber, yes, he married himself, Gordon Ramsay, Chelsea Clinton, LeBron James, Ariana Grande, every mumble rapper, Timothy Chalamet, Khloe Kardashian, Keenan Slovis, David Beckham, and Joe Biden. We may never truly know how many of the people we idolized are in fact this same Florbtron that started out as Gregory Peck. But what we do know is that aliens are in charge. We're just merely players in their game. Ancient aliens. Not spicy enough.